Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hi, hello, good morning everyone. Welcome back to our English class with Teacher Yet. How are you today? I hope all of you are doing fine. Alhamdulillah. Are you ready to learn new things? If you are ready, grab your textbook and turn to page 81. Let's get started. Our learning objective for today are, by the end of our lesson, people should be able to First, read one's diary. Second, to learn how to use intensifiers. Very, so, really, in a sentence. And third, to revise vocabularies and stretches learned in previous lessons. Our topic for today is my diary and intensifiers. You may refer to your textbook, page 81. Let's begin our lesson by reading a diary. I have underlined some words in red. Focus and remember those words. On Saturday morning, I was at the shopping center with my mother. It was very noisy. On Saturday afternoon, I was at the park. It was fun. On Sunday morning, I was at the zoo with my father. There were wolf and lions. The lions were so scary. On Sunday evening, I was at a restaurant. It was boring, but the vegetable soup was really delicious. Those words in red lines are called intensifiers. Intensifiers in BM is kata penguat. For example, sangat, amat, paling, dan agak. Intensifiers are used to emphasize another adjective or adverb. Here are some intensifiers, but for today's lesson, we will focus on three intensifiers which are very, so, and really. Intensifiers are placed in front of adjective and adverb to make them stronger. Intensifiers in front of the adjective or adverb. These are the examples of how intensifiers make the adjective stronger. For example, The woman is beautiful. Wanita itu cantik. If we are using the intensifier, it will become the woman is very beautiful. Wanita itu sangat cantik. The second example is She did well on the test. If we are using the intensifier, it will become She did very well on the test.
We can also use intensifiers to meaning something negative. For example, The rotten egg smelled bad. Telo yang rosa itu berbau busuk. If we are using the intensifier, it will become The rotten egg smells really bad. Telur yang rosa itu berbau sangat busuk. Here are some other examples. It was very noisy. Ia sangat bising. The lions were so scary. Singa-singa itu sangat menakutkan. The vegetable soup was really delicious. Sup sayur itu sangat sedap. You seem really tired. Are you okay? Kamu kelihatan sangat penat. Kamu baik ke? He's so excited. He can't wait. Dia sangat teruja. Dia tidak boleh tunggu lagi. That's the end of our lesson. For tutorial, we write these sentences and put the intensifiers in the correct place. Do the exercise in your E1. The first question is, the shopping center was noisy. Second question, John's new toy was boring. Third question, my book was interesting. Fourth question, the water is cold. The fifth question, I'm tired. I need to go to bed. And the last question is, that's a nice coat. That's all. Bye.